Welcome to the Leo Battle Food Crip Show. Alright guys, and these yums travel all the way from the land of poets and thinkers, Leo. We think it's Scotland. Ireland. Ireland. One of them. It's Ireland! Ireland! So guys, Universal Yums, Super Yum Box, and let's crack it open and see you see you saying Ireland. The land of poets and thinkers is Ireland. Is that where you're going with? Yeah. Alright. All right, and I will, I will tentatively agree with you. Okay, guys, here it is. Oh, it's welcome to Germany. Germany. So there it is, guys. I we thought it's the land of poets and thinkers. So apparently, it's poets and thinkers in Germany, and Dude, okay. Fry chips. So here is. So we have the areas of Cologne, Hamburg, Berlin, Weimar, um, Frankfurt, and Munich. They sent beer, a lot of beer going on over there. And here's the back of this guys, where you can keep score of all of this stuff. Uh, we have our own score on the boogie board for you guys who may be just joining us for the first time. And of course there's some puzzles here and there's a hit the pot. Uh, okay, great. Okay, guys, so. Fried chips. All right, so let's see what we got here. So we got. Shackles. Okay. Palmas curry, curry burst is um, a uh, meat flavored snack that looks like fries from what I'm gathering here. Hey, look, it's shackles. Oh, yeah, guys, check it out. Leo's. <laughs> and it also kind of. From, it, it's, from it's, the the Dodge, it's the Dodge emblem symbol from. Backwards. Okay, guys, and here's the book. We will take a look at that at the end as you. Okay, guys, so usually what we do is we just whip through this whole thing, and I'm trying to figure out how to navigate this because this is really hard to do. What is There's so much stuff. So we have Schinken and Casa. Krista. Casa, Krista. Okay, what do you got there? It looks like sugar covered candy grapes. Okay, we have. Are these almonds maybe? We have Gilbert's. Hey guys, guys. Know. Let's see, we have kind of guys. candy of some sort. Candy pack! Uh oh, oh, oh the guys. Whole pack, the we whole kitten from Boodle. Another, uh, another candy pack here guys. Uh, we'll get to that. Oh, when I see it, it's a romantic chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> romantic bottle cap chocolates. For Kinder, so uh, <laughs> it's about the opposite of uh, about the opposite of romantic guys. Definitely not. This is for kids. That's what it says. For kids, nothing romantic there. Uh, some sort of cups. Oh no! Onion rings. Ooh. Oh. It's bringing out your weakness. You. Yeah. Oh th wait. This yeah, I don't know if I'm having these guys. I'm not a, cookie chocolate. Not a fan of uh, onions at all. Dude, what do we got here? From the package, I'm deceiving. It's strawberry inside of chocolate. Oh yeah, guys, classic, classic. Oh, this is chocolate with raspberry, dude. Chocolate raspberry. Yes, yeah. sir. Chocolate with raspberry cream. Orange wafer cookies. Orange wafer. No, these are lemon. Lemon wafer cookies. Cool. Blueberry. Wafer cookies. Okay. Blueberry waffle cookies. Waffle. Waffle. Waffle cookies. Oh, look. Did you find more waffle cookies? Great. Oh, whoa. Yeah, it looks like, huh? Mm hmm. Yeah, Cassie. That's great. What it's else this we got? Sort, it's this sort of package heavy. Yeah, it's, the, the, these crates are gigantic, guys, as you can see. Okay, we got. Uh, emblem symbol. Pe peanut butter pearls of some kind. Leo, Leo wants you to know that this is like the upside down Mopar symbol, guys. Uh, we and have. Shackles. 
<laughs> Shackles. We have some sort of crisp here. Cracker of some kind. Strawberry chocolate. Okay. Is this strawberry this time? Oh yeah, strawberry rhubarb star bar. And then you can read these two. A flower. All the way. Let's see if I can. Flower power. It's reading some crazy glare out of here. Flower. Okay, flower. and what we got? We got oh, we got a hedgehog slice. Oh, we have poppy seed. I don't know what those things all, are. All sun, all sunrise bars. Okay, we got sunrise bars. Okay, so we don't need. We only need two of those. I'm wondering what. Put two this of those is. off to the side. This. Uh, Mars pan stolen. Uh, it's a. Uh, this is like a big thing. I'll have to get a knife for this one, guys. So we'll Ew. save that for one of the very ends. And there, Leo is wearing our crate as a hat, the crate box. No, it's a helmet. Uh, okay, of course it's like it is. a gladiator helmet. So, guys, there is all the stuff from this crate, guys. Which is we had to put everything in the crate there last time actually because we didn't have room. Actually. In fact, guys, I think we're gonna do that this time too. So let me go grab grab, grab that crate, crate again, buddy. Okay, guys. So here's how this usually works. We don't we don't have any um, do we DIY kits in these crates, and there's no drinks usually. So wait, we're these gonna go through stuff peanut, and try. roasted peanuts. Okay. So what are you going with? I, Leo's first choice here, guys. I wanted to go with one of these, uh, so I'm going with this. Okay. So okay, guys. So this is what Leo has chosen. These cups here. You know what they look like? Chocolate bottle caps. I do look like chocolate bottle caps. Okay, and let's see here. You can see, oh, 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 Okay, there you go. Grab one, Ooh. two, whatever. Okay, all right, guys, we're gonna go with one. Leo's a little bit leery of these crates, guys. So the second one of these that we've done. Um, mm. and he... I dig this. He does not like these as consistently as a Japan crepe. Japan I agree. Crepe. Those Bad. are pretty good. Okay, next pick for me guys, I'm gonna do these. Sunrise. The sunrise things. No thanks. You go for it. Oh. Look. Look at what it is. It's peanuts. No, no, is it? It, it says... It says quaffers hmm. plus quallen plus nuts. It says noose. But there is hazelnut in it for sure. So, Don't. no go. Guys, this is like a um, crunch a crunch bar. I, I, I like crunch. I like dark chocolate crunch bars. They're the best. Mm hmm. And I think maybe. I, I think I'm going to go with the candy pack. The whole kitten caboodle. Okay guys, so our next few are gonna be this. All right in a row. Now let's see what we got. There should be two of each. We got this. Packets. I don't know what this is. Himbeer? Oh, these are things, okay, there's orange. These apparently are things we have to mix up and drink. All right guys, so we're gonna come back to these at the end, there's one orange. And there's one of him beer, whatever that is. Okay, and guys, we have these, which I believe are chocolates of some kind. And let's see, we got guys. They look like those green, people. orange, blue. They look like what? They look like those, like guys. You know those eagle chocolates? And then we have a gold one too. <gasps> Golden. All right, and so what do we have here? So we have three orange. This is kind of strange. All right, guys, and we have one silver, and we have, is that all we have of those? Okay. All right, so we each have one blue one each, so let's give that a whack. Oh, whoa. And there it is, guys. It will be hypnotized. Hmm. <laughs> it's just chocolate. Ugh. It is just chocolate. It's good. So we're gonna try the orange one here. If there's no difference to this, we'll just call them all the same. No difference at all. Alright guys. Leo's right. There's no difference to those. So, they're just 
different color wrappers, I guess. All right. We have these, which look like hard candy of some kind, like bottle caps almost. And there's a bunch of these, so. Horseshoe bottle cap thing. Horseshoe bottle cap. Mm hmm. This crate looks like it's pretty heavy with sweet stuff, so. I need scissors to cut this. Oh, wow. Is it fizzy? Whoa. Is it fizzy? Very much so. Whoa. Oh, yeah. I love fizzy mm. stuff. Yep. It's, oh. Yeah, so these are fizzy things. <laughs> oh. I like them. Guys, okay, guys, so guys. that was a yes for me. Leo, is that a yes for you? Yeah. Guys, guys, you know one of those bath robbers that fizz and then your bathtub, your bathtub water turns to colors? Uh-huh. Uh, it feels like that same thing, but with flavor and in my mouth. Very nice, very nice. Okay, guys, so we have apple, we have berry, apple and berry. We have, it oh, looks like, Possibly a pomegranate of some type, and we have grapefruit, guys. So there are there's an apple, and there's also a berry for each of us. And then I think we'll just pick which of the other flavors you want. If you want to go with the grapefruit, or if you want to go with the other one, or we could split them. Should we split them? That's true. Oh yeah. What are these? Some sort of gum. No, not gum. Oh. It's chewy candy. Mm. Oh yeah. Wow, this is good. Yeah, these are like Starburst. Or yeah. high chew. Yeah, or like high chew. Alright, I'm gonna cut those other ones. Let me go grab that. Guys, when you open this, this looks like gum. Okay. Alright guys, so we're gonna you wanna go with the grapefruit or this other one first? Pomegranate. Okay. I don't know what I mean, what this actually means. No, I didn't want the pomegranate. I said that was the other name. Maracuja, whatever. I don't know what it actually is, so we'll try that one. Maracuja. We'll cut it in half. Half for you. Half for me. Hmm. That one's a little funky. Weirdest. Yeah. Uh, on this list right here, I'll pick weirdest. That was pretty weird, yeah. And then let's try the grapefruit next. But delicious at the end, actually. Was it? Okay, mm -hmm. here you go. Grapefruit, they all look the same. I'll put it on second best. All right, guys, so I'm gonna mix up these packets, too. Okay, guys, we're ready. Okay, guys, so there they are. Cups are not precisely equal, but Oops. here's orange. Right. So we're gonna do this, Leah's good. Try a sip and pass it back to me. Fizzy! So why don't we stir it in? We're going to stir it in just a second. Alright, whatever this one is. Okay. Stir, 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 stir. Alright, which one do you want to try? The pink one or the orange one? I'll go pink. Okay, take a little sip and then take it back to me. How is it? Oh, weird. Oh, oh weird. All right, guys, here we go. Hmm, I like that one. And that was pretty orange. good. Okay, take a little sippy of the old orange. I probably know what this tastes like, though. No difference at all to a normal orange juice in America. Okay. okay. It's really good. All right, so we'll finish those off later. So both of those are yes? Yes. Okay. Both of them are yes. I'm gonna go with this, guys. Promise, 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 promise. Currywurst, currywurst. I'm not gonna try any. All right, guys. No thanks. Oh, whoa, whoa, look at these. Guys, okay, you see these? These are cool. Look at these. They're like tubes. Look, I can see Leo through this one. Let's see if we can pull it in with the camera. Barely. Hmm. I don't know. You want to try one? No thanks. I'm not quite sure what this taste actually is. 
Hmm. Those, those remind me of those ve- No! They are chips. They're, it reminds me of those veggie sticks. Yeah, yeah, kind of. They're really good. Yeah. I didn't know if they were going to be. Which one should I do next? All right. What do you think, buddy? Which, what will it be? A uh, blueberry wafer cookies. <laughs> Buffer cookies. Buffer is probably just another, it's just a different, it's just a word to say. In so Heidelbeer is apparently blueberry. So that blue, that other drink guys we had was blueberry. Okay. So, oh, whoa, 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 get out of get out of hand. Get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it. Alright. So Leo picked. So here it is. Leo picked it. You get to go first. Ooh la la, this looks like a wafer cookie. Yep. And he's a wafer cookie. So far these uh Herbers things are by far the best thing in the scrape to me. They're really good. This is actually one of the best things I've ever the one cookie? of the best things the I've blueberry? Had. Okay. One of the best things I've had. So we're gonna know is one. Alright guys. I need to know what a hedgehog slice is. <laughs> <laughs> hedgehog slice. <laughs> Oh, three free hedgehogs in every bite. All right, guys, I don't know why they call this a hedgehog bite. There's mm -hmm. cookies in it. So it's like, if you, oh, it's like graham crackers. That must be what it is. Oh, it's like a s'mores, guys. Graham crackers, and it looks like marshmallow or something there. That was good. Not great, but good. All right, buddy. Hey. Now for my choice, I think I'll go with this. Blueberry wafer cookies. Great. Blueberry good? Oh, this is great, yeah. And I know okay, guys. You know, the, the curry worst things, I was really glad they put those in there because it gives it a nice break from all the sweet. This is a pr pretty sweet taste so far. Looks like the blueberries. It's sort of light purplish lavender color, and let's see how it is. I've never, I like these wafer cookies in general. I've never had a grape before. And uh, after this, I don't think I'm ever going to have a grape again. Ooh. Oh. Do you like this? Oh, dude. I, I'm going to mark it on the worst one. Yeah, this is bad. All right. That's a no for me also. But it is, but the blueberry is a good one. Yeah, blueberry is good. Hmm. Him beer must be raspberry. This one's obviously raspberry. All right, guys, we're gonna not go with that, and instead we're gonna go with uh, oh, what these things? Peanut plastic. Like peanut peanut Cheetos, I guess. So it looks like to me. Let's try one. I'll take a pit pass on it. Oh, that's a mistake. There's no peanuts in them. Just so flavoring. You gotta try this. It tastes like, guys, it tastes like dry roasted. Wow. That's <laughs> really good. Holy moly. Do we bear bears would love this? Yeah. I, know, I know I definitely do. So one for you, and then I'll write a P for pass. Okay. So. I actually made a mistake here, guys. So I meant to write one on here, and I wrote one on there. Oh, that's okay. So that's why I crossed it out. Okay. So I'll mark one for you, and I'll not, and then I'll do a P. Those peanut things were fantastic, guys. So far, my favorite thing is the curry worst, but those peanuts were a very close second. Those are awesome. Um, Leo's totally missing out. Okay. Should I what oh, looks exciting? Orange version. Ah, yes, the lemon boppers. All right, guys. And I guess you can open it somehow in here. Let's see if we can figure out how to open this. Uh, time Leo gets back. 
Let's see here. I'm back. There we go. All right. This should be good. It's just the orange version, orange version of the grape. It's still lemon, but sure. It's still lemon. Okay, I'm guys. ready to mark it. This thing is like fighting me way too much, so let's get out Mr. Scissors. I'm ready to. I'm okay. ready to mark. So these are also triple layers. Here you go. So I know where the orange one is. Still lemon. Lemon. Okay, oh, guys. Oh. Oh. I have had lemon wafers before. That's good. And this is another very good version of that. I think it is too. So it is marked two points on best. <laughs> okay. Okay, guys. Um, I'm going to go with this. This looks like some sort of Swiss cheese snack. I'll say no thanks. Oh, this is like, it's this, this is another one like the Cheetos. So this is like the puff shapes that they have. Yeah, this is just, uh, it's, it's just like a different cheese flavor of, of Cheetos. Oh, so it's, it's almost more like Gouda, actually. Gouda? Mm -hmm. A little smokiness to it. Not bad. Not great. I wouldn't. I don't know if I'd buy these on purpose, but Leah didn't enjoy them very much, I guess. Hmm. I mostly probably know on those too. So I thought they were. Up. I thought they were okay, but I don't want any more of them. They're not that good. I'm okay, like, so we're I'm down to I'm our I'm last. I'm like two on worse. Okay, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're down to our last seven, guys. I'm All going right. with the raspberry filling chocolate. Okay. Now I have to find it on my chart so I know which one is the mark. Oh. Okay, raspberry so filling chocolate. Right off the bat. Good work. Okay, guys. Oh, whoa. Mm -hmm. This is an interesting break for these. Okay. Oh, they smell good. Oh. This is a darker chocolate, which is good because this filling is super sweet, guys. Hm. I think I'll mark two on um, best. I'm not a big fan of these either, actually. Which one do you want to be in on? Second best? Not even close. Worst? No. Just, it's just okay. It's a no for me, though. Guys are really intensely heavy here with... With the sweet stuff, guys, I'm gonna try to jump into this one. I'm gonna say there's a crack. I know which one to mark, so I'm gonna just write a P because I'm gonna pass. Okay, guys. I'm, I'm gonna Whoa! No thanks. Hmm. Oh. Oh, you are missing out. These are spectacular. Hey. Look at the surface of the moon. Okay, I'll write one, and then, I'll, and then I just wrote a piece. Oh, these yeah, are so good. I'm not sure what flavor that is, but... And I don't know what these are actual pictures of, because you can see it doesn't match the reality, but they're really good. Okay. These are smoked cheddar, I know that. Okay. Now, it's time for me to... Okay. And huh. I think I'll pick whatever these are. They look like grapes. You still got the strawberry rhubarb over there. Okay, so these are almonds coated with hazelnut chocolate. Oh no. I have a feeling I'm not going to like them. I'm going to like, just write a P on it. So I'm passing. Okay, guys. Look like little eggs. So it's an almond basically coated in like Nutella and power trigger. I think you actually would like these a lot if you tried one. They're pretty good. Now guys, so we have four left. Right now, the score is 13 to 9. Who's 9? You. 
If I continue to hold the lead, guys, this, this will make, guys, the fourth crate in a row that I've either tied with Leo or like more things than him, which, again, is pretty unusual. Okay, so it's, so it's my pick this time. And, yeah, I'm going to go with the chocolate with poppy seeds. No thanks. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna find that. That's you, you wanna go with the chocolate with poppy seeds? Okay, I'm writing a P. <laughs> how many items why don't you count how many items there are in there? Okay. I'll count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three. Okay, guys, so here it is. Oh, wow. That is awesome. You're making a mistake not having this one, too. That's really good. So then, all right, one. And I think I'll go with the Strawberry Star Bar. All right. And we have two left after this, guys. I don't know if Leo is going to be brave enough to try the Funyuns. The Funyuns? Basically. I love I love I love me some funyuns. Guys, leave a comment let us know what your favorite snack is. Here you go. And you can see there's the strawberry rhubarb bar. Oh! Mmm! That is really, really good. Mm-hmm. It is very This one and the uh poppy are awesome. Alright guys, so I am not brave enough. To uh, even consider attempting the Funyuns. But I am. So, I'm going to go with this. Pass, pass, pass. I'm passing. You're passing this thing? Yeah, I'm going to have to turn this over and to see guys. which one it is. This is the marzipan bread thing. Oh, whoa. Looks like a fruitcake almost. Mmm. Wow. Oh, wow. Guys, I was not expecting this. This is very good. Okay. Are you sure you don't want to try this? Nope. Wow. Now, last but not least, the fun one. Oh, so good. All right. I'm going to take a look at you guys and show them off to you. I'm going to smell one even. Oh, no. Nope. Nope. Look at the miniature funions. Hang on, try one. Oh, what? There's funions. Oh yeah, those... Guys, this tastes like funions. Is that yes for you? Yep. Alright. Okay guys, our final score. 16 for me, 11 for Leo. And, okay guys, so there was 20 things on the list today, and I liked 16 of them, and Leo liked 11. So, let's take a look at the book. Willkommen, hmm, Willkommen in Deutschland. Which guys, of course, is Welcome to Germany. Almost. Almost. Very nice, very nice, okay. So it's cold over there. Yeah. Deutsch Sprechen, and there are, apparently there a lot of discussion of the pigs. Okay, here's a castle. Whoa, very cool, guys. It looks like a castle you'd see at Disney or something. Ah, it was, it was a castle <laughs> for Walt Disney's Sleeping Beauty. Brandenburg Gate, very, very cool. The Black Forest, guys. More things like Snow White and Hansel and Gretel might have been. There is some different trivia about Jeremy. And guys, let's whip through the book. So we had the Lauren's Curly Peanut Puffs. Okay, guys, so there is this one. Leo chose a pass on this. This was my second favorite thing from the crate. Second favorite? Okay, I'll mark that. I'll mark that. Okay, so the peanut puffs were my second favorite thing. So we have the poppy seed bar, guys. Second favorite. 
And this thing, guys, was another bit of awesomeness from Shaka Monk. Uh, Leo passed this one, actually. So we have the lemon voppers. Lemon voppers? Let me see about the lemon voppers. <laughs> lemon voppers were a two. They're declared a two. Leo gave this a two, guys, which I'm assuming means his second favorite thing. No, the two. Two means you like it and I like it. Oh, gotcha. Okay, well, so what was your favorite thing? My favorite thing out of the crate was the strawberry rhubars. That was pretty good. So we have these, which are the sort of funyun icky things. I took a pass on that, guys. It's the only thing I did not try. It's Hazelnut Sunrise. Now, this is a bar that Leo elected also not to try. Okay, so you liked it, so you'll do the good, one yep. and then the pea. So, oh, the fruitcake. Yep, it was. It was a fruitcake, guys, after all. Yep, here it is. This is that Mars and fruitcake. And, oh, that was excellent. Okay, guys, and this one is the... Oh, it was ham and cheese. Leo, they were ham and cheese chips. I know. Those square things. You said they were smoked cheddar. That would explain the smoky dish, though. Hmm. Um, I, I'm not... A fan of those. Okay, guys, and here we have the dark chocolate with the raspberry cream. That was a very good one. All the raspberry cream was super sweet to the point where I didn't like it. Well, yeah, I believe did like it. We have chocolate coated almonds, which I thought were really, really good also. We had the hedgehog slice bar. Basically, it's a German version of graham crackers. That was really good. We have these. Ketchup and curry powder. So they made currywurst flavored potato fries. And these were by far my favorite thing. They were neat. Oh my gosh, guys. Those were awesome. That was really good. We also have these. Oh. Okay, so this is black currant. It wasn't grape. It was black currant. But I still didn't like this one. We have these herb flavored crackers, which were also excellent. Leo did not like, Leo did not try those actually. So that was another P. Another P. And guys, we have, oh, this is bilberry cream. I don't know. They, they were blueberries for me, but they're bilberries apparently. I don't know what the difference is. You guys can read through this and uh, see what the difference is if you guys can pull it in. Mini torties. Oh, this is the chocolate with milk cream. And this was the, the kid the kid little cup thing. This is the first one we tried. It was really good. And you, can, you can put it in the fridge too, apparently, and have it be really good. Uh, we had the fizzy drinking powder. We did I? Which apparently they mixed with vodka. Uh. But we're not obviously doing that for this video. We also have blueberry strawberry stra hooey, strawberry rhubarb shakamuk bars, which is the star bar that Leo likes so well. <laughs> cool little pencil flip. The yum bag was the lucky fizzy coins and the sour fruit toffees. Those were. Also really, really good. And of course, the confection squares of whatever cool melting chocolate means. Okay guys, and we also have Women's Day. Women's Day over in uh, Germany. We have Rose Monday. We have Shrove Tuesday. And apparently it's a carnival thing that they have over there. And we have Schweineschnitzel. Hmm? Guys, look at my face. Say it again. Schweineschnitzel? <laughs> my face is like, what is that? Okay, guys, and this is a meat dish that is made with pork. Schweineschnitzel, German schnitzel made with pork. Okay, guys, and here's all the trivia answers. And 
There it is, guys. So there's the book for Germany. So our second uh, Universal Young Crate, guys. This one was Germany. And what did you think about Germany? Germany. Germany, Germany, Germany. Leo, Leo liked about half of this crate. The same as the first crate, which was all a little something of everything, guys. I liked it. I like some of the crate, and the rest of it is just like, eh. Well, Leah took a lot of passes on stuff, so he didn't actually try some of these. The last time we had this crate, he did the same thing, guys, and then wound up trying some of those later and liking some of those, which may be the case here, guys. As for me, I liked almost all of the stuff that was in this crate, guys. It was overall, guys, for me, a very, very solid crate, guys. And, of course, with the Universal Yums, you can see, guys, it's a ton of stuff. There it is, back what we have left after unboxing everything. Anyway, guys, there's our look at the second Universal Young's Crate, guys, for the channel, guys. This one is Deutschland, Germany, guys, and which is apparently the land of poets and thinkers, guys. There you go. Guys, if you enjoyed our look at this, please give us the old thumbs up, guys. Hit the red subscribe button if you have not done so already, guys. Hit the blue bell next to the red subscribe button, guys. And you can also follow us on our Twitter feed, guys. If you would care to do that, guys. Also, if you would like to leave us a comment, guys, let us know if you like these crates, what your favorite type of food is, guys, from around the world. Leo's is probably American, I'm guessing. <laughs> mine is mine is probably Japanese still, guys. Although I uh, I thought this crate was really good, and there's a lot of German food that. I like as well, guys. So this this should be a lot of fun as we dig more into these crates, guys. Definitely hope you stay tuned for that. But yeah, drop a slide, guys, if you would like to do that, guys. We try to respond to everything that we get. Anyway, that's gonna do it for us this time. We will see you all next time. Bye bye.